Deep beneath the surface of southern China, a groundbreaking scientific facility is taking shape the Jiangmen Underground Neutrino Observatory, or Juno. This impressive structure is poised to transform our understanding of the universe by studying neutrinos' elusive particles that rarely interact with ordinary matter. At the heart of Juno is the world's largest acrylic sphere, designed to capture these ghost particles and reveal their secrets. As we explore Juno's innovative construction, its ambitious goals, and the technological advancements that make it possible, you'll discover why this project matters so much and how it could reshape our knowledge of the cosmos. Let's dive into the fascinating world of neutrino research. The Jiangmen Underground Neutrino Observatory Juno represents a remarkable achievement in particle physics, specifically designed to detect neutrinos, particles so elusive they are often referred to as ghost particles. Central to Juno's design is its massive acrylic sphere, which stands at an astonishing 35.4 meters in diameter and reaches 12 stories tall. This gigantic structure has been carefully constructed to house a total of 20,000 tons of liquid scintillator. An essential component that enables the detection of neutrinos through faint flashes of light generated during interactions. Positioned 700 meters underground in the granite of a hill in southern China, Juno is strategically located to shield its sensitive detectors from cosmic rays and other external interference that could compromise data accuracy. The installation of the innermost acrylic sphere is now complete, marking a significant milestone in the construction process. The engineering team faced numerous challenges, such as creating photomultiplier tubes PMTs that possess the highest photon detection efficiency globally. These tubes are crucial for converting the faint light produced by neutrino interactions into measurable signals. In addition to the acrylic sphere, Juno's design includes a comprehensive purification system to maintain the liquid scintillator's purity. This meticulous attention to detail ensures that the liquid remains free from contaminants, as even minuscule impurities can hinder the detection process. The team has established that the dust level in the liquid must not exceed 0.008 grams in 20,000 tons, highlighting the project's emphasis on precision. Juno's location, 53 kilometers from the Yangyang and Taiyashan nuclear power plants, is intentional. This distance allows researchers to observe neutrino oscillation, the phenomenon where neutrinos switch between types providing valuable data on how these particles behave. As the construction nears completion, the technological advancements and engineering feats associated with Juno are not just impressive, they promise to open new doors in our understanding of fundamental physics. Juno's primary scientific goal is to determine the neutrino mass hierarchy, which has profound implications for our, our understanding of particle physics and the nature of the universe. The concept of neutrino mass hierarchy refers to the relationship between the masses of the three known types of neutrinos electron, muon and tau neutrinos. While it's established that neutrinos possess mass, the precise differences between their masses remain a mystery. Unlocking this hierarchy could significantly enhance our theoretical models of the universe. One of the compelling reasons why understanding the neutrino mass hierarchy is crucial is its potential to explain the imbalance between matter and antimatter in the universe. This imbalance is a fundamental question in cosmology and insights into neutrino behavior could explain why we observe more matter than antimatter. Furthermore, determining the mass hierarchy could refine our understanding of fundamental forces and particles central to the standard model of particle physics. In addition to exploring mass hierarchy, Juno aims to investigate various types of neutrinos, including atmospheric neutrinos generated by cosmic events, solar neutrinos emitted from the sun, and neutrinos produced within the Earth itself. By detecting these different sources of neutrinos, Juno will offer a holistic view of how neutrinos interact with matter and how they influence cosmic processes. Each of these studies will contribute to our understanding of the mechanisms driving significant astrophysical phenomena, including supernova explosions. With its cutting-edge technology and strategic location, Juno is set to capture approximately 40 reactor neutrinos and thousands of solar neutrinos every day. 
The comprehensive data collection over six years is anticipated to yield groundbreaking results, potentially revealing patterns and behaviors of neutrinos that have remained elusive. This research not only seeks to clarify our current models, but may also uncover entirely new physics beyond the standard model. As we delve deeper into the intricacies of these particles, the findings from Juno could challenge existing theories and pave the way for new discoveries in both particle physics and cosmology. The technological innovations driving the Juno project are a testament to the engineering prowess and scientific ingenuity involved in its construction. One of the standout features of Juno is its commitment to creating a reliable and efficient detection system. This is particularly evident in the development of advanced photomultiplier tubes, PMTs, which are designed to maximize photon detection efficiency. These tubes are essential for capturing the faint flashes of light produced when neutrinos interact with the liquid scintillator. Moreover, the observatory's design incorporates an innovative purification system that ensures the liquid scintillator remains uncontaminated. The ability to maintain such high purity levels is critical, as any impurities can significantly impact the accuracy of neutrino dino detection. This level of precision demonstrates the engineering team's dedication to overcoming the challenges posed by such a large-scale scientific endeavor. Collaboration is another key element of Juno's success. The project has brought together over 700 scientists from 74 institutions across 17 countries. This international collaboration enhances the quality of research and fosters a community of experts, each contributing their unique skills and knowledge. The shared goal of uncovering the mysteries of neutrinos has created a dynamic environment where ideas and techniques are exchanged freely, promoting innovation and progress. As Juno approaches its operational phase, the anticipation surrounding its findings continues to grow. With plans to begin full operations in August 2025, scientists are eager to see how this observatory will advance our understanding of the fundamental particles that make up our universe. In addition to the technological advancements, the project showcases cutting-edge engineering practices, including advanced data processing and analysis techniques. These innovations will allow scientists to sift through vast amounts of data generated by neutrino interactions, identifying patterns and anomalies that could lead to groundbreaking discoveries. The technological advancements and collaborative spirit behind Juno not only highlight the importance of teamwork in scientific research, but also signify a step forward in humanity's quest for knowledge about the cosmos. In this video, we have learned about the Jiangmen Underground Neutrino Observatory Juno and its monumental role in advancing our understanding of neutrinos those elusive particles that hold the key to many cosmic mysteries. We explored Juno's remarkable construction, its ambitious scientific goals, and the innovative technologies that make it a leading facility in particle physics. We hope you learned something new. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to leave a comment below and tell us what you think about this news and what you would like to know more about. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.